What's up, ladies and gents? I'm your host, Sinistrator One, and welcome back to more Sticks, Shards of Darkness. I think we only have about a couple more missions left, so I am going to be going through all these missions today, hopefully having them finished, because Mass Effect is coming around, and I want to make sure that we have at least one of these walkthroughs done before I start anything else. Um, and trust me when I say that all those are going to be finished. Promise is a promise, and this is a new year. 2017 has been good so far, and I want to keep it going that way. So, uh, yeah, let's keep going. Uh, first off, let's see, as far as skills go, we've got one pure quartz and a bunch of stuff to do with absolutely no reason to do it. Um, I mean, we might as well just go ahead and... Oh, that's cool. Not that that's ever going to come in handy, but still cool nonetheless. Just kind of going through the motions of upgrading as much as possible. Looks like we are back here again. Except this time she's no longer with us. I don't know why we didn't get her out, but um, that was just the game wouldn't let us get her out or anything like that. So let's talk to Jark. If I got this right, the elves are consuming Amber, and Lysril is turning them into fanatical slaves. Exactly the kind of shitty side effect that I've seen before, and that I'd like to get rid of. The alliance with the dwarves has allowed Lysril to obtain the amber that she's using to subdue my people. Breaking that fragile union will free them, and prevent Lysril from getting her hands on you again. All right, you got my attention. Keep talking. The dwarf ambassador is still in Korangar. Let's make it look as though Maolag was his assassin. I noticed that she carries a very nice dagger on her belt. <laughs> the sacred dagger. Perfect. You should find it in her personal quarters. Once I borrow it, I'll stick it in the dwarf ambassador's back without being seen. What's your role in the story, partner? My job is to get information about the exact location of the reserves of Amber. I still have some contacts in Korangar. Don't, did I already find those uh, amber reserves? <laughs> Just thinking out loud here. Um, all right, so we're going to go ahead and uh, leave the hideout, start the mission. Hopefully you guys enjoy, and of course, it's go time. Mm. Night. I don't think they came here for the dancing. The High Priestess Lyseril asks if the dagger is safe. It is. It was. Why this question? The young. They didn't find the goblin. Liarch! <sighs> Malak is pissed, but not pissed enough. Uh, Kaka Paka. Mukapupi, uh, whatever. The priestess with the stupid name. She must have gone to the dome. I gotta get hold of her pendant to open the door leading to that dagger. And this is another mission where I can't afford being detected. Did you hear that? <laughs> I just love that. Alright, so we just need to reach the dome. <clears throat> Doesn't say anything else about... Anything else. <laughs>
Alright, so far so good. Gotta be one of these doors. Okay, so I'm looking for maybe... <clears throat> Another way up beside the, the north. Okay, we got dwarfs, not a good sign. So we might have to use our invisibility here if he's coming down. Okay. I'm not really sure how the whole how they smell you or sense you. I see a way right there. So that's how I can get over there, and that should be good to go. Shit. I can't hear a thing. I'll have to get closer without being spotted. If only I could use my drone from Ghost Recon. our right. It is a terrible insult to us all. We have had to terminate the mortal lives of many amongst us. We bow to your honorable decision, Mother Superior. It is for the common good. We must pray for all these souls, so that they return purified. We shall have the honor of escorting you, Priestess Maolak. These two guards are all over her ass. Oh, she's gotta take a piss sometime. I just need to follow them quietly until I can get her alone. So we're going to wait till she moves. A shard of pure quartz. Mm. Stealing it won't be simple, and getting out with it even less so. Perfect. Because victory without risk is like bread without butter. And I like a little butter. Mm. Surprising.
Pretty shards, all in a row. It was just a shadow. Nothing. Okay, we did it. Two arms, Castasil! The quartz has disappeared! Close the door! Find the thief and slit his throat! Okay, so we gotta go to there. To jump down, there's one right there. Would that thou grant strength and agility to our bodies, purify our hearts, and may our pain atone for our misdeeds. Let not our hands tremble when we slay our foes, our bodies, our hearts, our hands are yours. Glory to Lysril, our light in the darkness, who protects us from impurity. Would that thou grant strength and agility to our bodies, purify our hearts, and may our pain atone for our misdeeds. Strength and agility to our bodies, purify our hearts. And may our pain atone for our misdeeds. Let not our hands tremble when we slay our foes. Our bodies, our hearts, our hands are yours. Glory to Lysril, our light in the darkness, who protects us from impurity. All right, so we're going to have to go out the same way we came in. Purify our hearts and may our pain atone for our misdeeds. Let not our hands tremble when we slay our foes. Our bodies, our hearts, our hands are yours. Glory to Lysril. I feel like this is a completely new place, but it's actually the same place that we were in before. Not what I wanted to do. But at least this is here. So we gotta go down there. Would that thou grant strength and agility to our bodies, purify our hearts, and may our pain atone for our misdeeds. Let not our hands tremble when we slay our bodies. don't like using the physical, but...
Right. Well, let's see if it works. Sesame, like the man said. Open. Ah, too easy. So, yeah. Gotta love these puzzles. Alright, so this is a simple puzzle of reflecting light. I said reflecting. <laughs> I like to make up my own words. Um, right now it's going into itself, so if we turn... Okay, but then we gotta get this one. So, this is too easy to be true. I better be ready for some surprises. Definitely. We have those, those things set up here. So you're going to need to be fast. Don't even get the dagger yet. All you want to do is get yourself into a position of where you're kind of behind some cover. And here we go. Oh crap, I just wasted that. My bad. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Oh. Oh, that's a good one. I wasted that because I didn't hit the button. <laughs> it's a trap. Pockets in! Pockets in! go. So, sorry for wasting that amber there, but we'll pick up some hopefully a little bit later, I guess. Make sure you go back. Just in case we need it again. And... Alright. Aaron. I never got a chance to finish what I started with him. This time, I do it right. Boy, these guards are not very good guards. The 
leave me now, and make sure that no one else enters. Very well, Lord Baron. So we're gonna have to use distractions. Finally dead, but it still leaves a taste of unfinished business. I'll piss on your grave, then I'll dig you up and kill you again. Then I'll piss on your grave again. After that, I hope never to have to even smell another member of your degenerate family. Then again, they never did anything to me. But that don't matter. I just love the commentary in this. The social commentary is, is great. We need to go up there, so actually... Best way to do that is here. I think there's one on the other side, too. Father, that elf insulted us. That wasn't a good reason to smash his bones. His death was more merciful than he deserved. Wow, this guy's all hard. I'd rather kiss a dwarf's ass than hang out with that huge freaking psycho. Hawkeye, your anger will be our doom. I just gotta find this dwarf diplomat, get rid of him, and the highlight of the show, make it look like Malak killed him. And all that with no witnesses and without triggering alarms. You got that? I got it. He's flanked by his two drunken guards. Mm. As an ambassador, he must receive messages every day. There should be a way to slip one in of my own creation that will convince him to come out alone. And if these dwarfs get so bored, he won't be able to pass up on an opportunity to do something fun and get rich. The 
presence of these drunken dwarfs is unbearable. It's an insult to the harmony of the, the great ambassador's cycle. office now must be around here somewhere. Welcome to the down. office yes, of Ambassador Nostralus Maximus. Well, no. just gotta drop off my no. enticing no. message and wait yes, for the fish. No. There we go. All I need now is for His Excellency El Big Nose to stumble on it. I like how you can tell them where you want them to go. like being back here again. Oh, they covered it up, though. Wasn't there a... So we just gotta head up. And now we just have to wait for him to to get here. I guess we're a little too fast. Should have enough some amber to craft. Nope. Let's see, we can craft these. These are good for taking out the other types of enemies. Now, this won't be quiet if we use that method. <laughs> right? Especially if there's enemies around. So he will be able to smell you out pretty much immediately. So as soon as he gets close enough, he's going to start smelling you out. No problem. Don't scare me, don't you? But give it a few seconds and you should be good. There's nothing you can do. I mean, once you get close to him, it's automatically going to smell you out. Left to complete my job is to accidentally let Maolak's dagger fall. Oops. The dwarfs will think it's these treacherous dark elves that did it. <laughs> well, well, what's this drawing in his pocket? Some kind of machine. Damn, it's written in dwarvish. Okay, better get out of here. Maybe Jarak will know what it's all about. All right, so we got to go back the same way we originally came in in this mission. This death does not seem natural.
Alright. Reach the balloon. Side mission is complete. Pick up any. Awesome job. The elves have assassinated the ambassador. So, that's one dead dwarf and a useful war brewing. Coming back to Karangar wasn't such a bad idea after all. <laughs> there you go, ladies and gents. So that was a fun mission. Not as long as the previous one, but uh, still fun nonetheless. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. We still got good swiftness time, so that's pretty good. Usually we don't usually get bronze swiftness time. Um, when you're going around doing Shadow and Mercy and stuff like that and all the, and the side missions. Uh, we did the two side quests. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you're enjoying. Uh, just a couple missions left, and then we'll be finishing up this walkthrough. Thank you so much for the support. Love you guys, and of course, I'll see you on the next one. Peace out. Bitches.